Did you get your money? Yeah. yeah. You didn't shut the door all the way. You never shut the door all the way. <laughs> I know, I know. You ready? Uh-huh. Brian's getting an interview right now. <laughs> and you can see him looking out here. <laughs> I'm really zoomed in right now, so I apologize if it's really shaky. Before I tell you where we're going next, let's just wait till he comes back to see how he thinks the interview went. It looks like it's about to storm. Uh, I don't know how how easily you can see. Well, my windshield is dirty, first of all. Sorry. But it's uh, really windy. And the sky, it, it looks like it's getting kind of dark. And we're zoomed in on Brian again because he's just waiting for his interview. Oh, now he took a drink. And he's looking still. And he looked back out here. He looks very nervous. I knew it was going to rain. I told you guys. Now I, I guess we're going to find out how much and how heavily it rains. I just really want to point out that Brian didn't even bring a jacket. So when he comes back to the truck, he's going to wish he brought a jacket. I usually always bring a jacket just in case. I don't care how warm it is. You never know if it's going to rain or if it's going to somehow get colder. So Brian's interview was scheduled to be at 4. It is now 4.16 and oh wait, well it turned off. Well it is now 4.17. It was 4.16 when I was showing you. But now it's 4.17 and he's been sitting in there. He was at least 10 or 15 minutes early. So he's been sitting in there for a while. You can't really see it that well. Uh, I don't even know if I got it focused in on the uh, <laughs> On the windshield or not but it's it's raining pretty heavily now now it's really coming down yeah brian's gonna have a fun time walking back to the truck it's getting even worse i mean i'm sure you can hear it i think it's funny he should have brought a jacket i got the job how do you know he told me he told me to call him friday and he'll get he was having an orientation date I'll be starting sometime next week. How excited are you? Really excited. It took forever for you to get that interview. I know. So, um, I bet you wish you brought a jacket. Yeah. <laughs> so as you can see, I'm wearing my jacket now. Something that Brian should have brought. And we already know that he regrets that he didn't. But I'm wearing it because I went into the store to get clothing measurements because I'm going to try to get into a movie. I'm not going to tell you guys anything about the movie uh, or anything like that because usually they like to keep that kind of stuff secretive. So I'm just going to keep it very simple by saying I'm trying to get a part in a movie. We'll see how this goes. Brian's on the phone right now. He said there's a snake. I don't, I don't see a snake. He makes me scared to go down there now. Okay, so ignore him talking in the background. I need to explain this. I was showing him the spot. And as I walked down there to get down, like I did last week in my video, I saw a big spider web. So I had to try to get back up. It's really muddy, so really slick. So as I tried to get back up, I grabbed his hand so he could pull me. And when I went up, I started sliding down again. And I'm doing the camera motions like I'm sliding down. <laughs> so yeah, I almost got tangled up in a bunch of spider webs. And he saved me. So whenever he gets off the phone, we can finish uh, recording this video. I plan to walk down the leaves side. It was raining earlier, as you saw in the video. Right now it's not, luckily, but it's very wet, very slick. So I want him to record me going down this side, just in case I do fall. Okay. I'm filming this for you guys in case you can see it. He said the snake's right here. You can see the tail. Where, where are you? I don't see it. You guys might see it. I don't see it. Since Brian saw a snake, I decided for our safety, because we have nothing to defend ourselves with, we are not going to be filming down here. So Brian, you can come on up here if you want. Well, I'm up here waiting on you. Just watch out for that snake. You ain't gotta tell me twice. By the way, he's carrying my camera box so I can actually film this. I always take the box oh. with me. Because you never know if it's going to rain or what's going to happen. If I need to set the camera somewhere, I'll have a box to set it in to keep it protected. 
So are you ready to start walking down the tracks and see what we find? Yeah. All right, let's go. Brian, I have no idea where we're going. I keep looking down because I feel like there's going to be a snake or something. You, you got me all worried now. I'm worried about this snake. Well, it wasn't a black snake, but I didn't know what kind of snake it was. Ah! <laughs> gotcha. Ah. <laughs> you alright? Yeah. Doesn't that look like water you want to jump in right now? Yeah, if I didn't have uh, good clothes on. You would jump in that right now? Not right now. <laughs> That's what I just asked you and you said yeah. If I didn't have these clothes on, yeah. So if you had clothes that you didn't mind getting dirty, you would jump in this? More than likely. <laughs> Are you sure about that? Uh, maybe there's probably some water snakes in there. Probably. Well, you, apparently you already saw one snake. Yeah, I did. Uh, might see some piranhas. You ain't gonna see no piranhas in that water. Um, turtles. <laughs> Maybe some turtles. Brian, there's a rock. <laughs> I didn't get you that time, did I? Nice try, Tyler. Nice try. Well, I've already took Brian back home, and here I am in my house. I hope you guys enjoyed the video, and I'll see you guys next time.